Um, doing this from my phone, my, I don't know, my movie maker program on my laptop is not working. I'm not feeling too well. And I just wanted to do this little uh, third part in the series of, of 7 inch singles, 45s, whatever you want to call it. Um, who knows, if the quality is better with my phone, I might use that instead of my laptop. Anyway, it's it's installing a new kind of movie maker thing. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, um, I've picked up a lot of 7 inches lately, um, around 20, 20 plus. Um, I'm going to incorporate them in upcoming um, parts of this series. There's uh, three, though, that I've already had uh, the letters for. Uh, that's A and B. So I'm going to show those first, and then I'm going to continue with the E's and F's. So, uh, yeah. Hopefully you enjoy these videos. If not, I don't care. This is uh, Kings of the Wild Frontier. This is all backwards, but I don't mind. Uh, Adam and the Ants. This is a UK copy. Yeah, did not have this one, so it's now part of the collection. I also, if you see this, uh, these videos that I'm doing, uh, I also try to pick up obscure things. Sometimes it works out, sometimes it doesn't. This time it did work out. This is Blue Zoo with Cry Boy Cry. Um, pretty interesting. Sort of a new wave, new romantics kind of sound. Uh, yeah, it was interesting. And then I also picked up uh, It Ain't Necessarily So by Bronsky Bead. And uh, yeah, that's for their, from their first album, I think. Jimmy Somerville on vocals. I like that. Okay, now let's start with the uh, series. I'm going to do the E's first. This is uh, Echo and the Bunny Man with a C chain, seven C's, sorry. Um, it's also got All You Need Is Love on the back. This is uh, an original on Corova Records. I love Corova. Um, now you're going to see the first of the non-picture sleeve 7 inches. Um, there's not a lot in this the 80s pop uh, series, but yeah, there's one. Uh, this is uh, Elvis Costello and the Attractions. It's an original on Radar. Uh, what is it? I forgot the name of it. Radar Records. And the song is um, Don't Want to Go to Chelsea. Yeah, you don't see it, but it is. Then we got Erasure. It doesn't have to be. And they do also a version of In the Hall of the Mountain King from Pierre Gint. Which is fun. It's on mute. Uh, I'm going to put that here. Uh, some German uh, New Wave. This is Erste Allgemeine Verunsicherung. Ba -ba 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 -bank um, this is okay. You know, it's not the great stuff from that genre, but it's okay. This is another obscure 7 inch. This is Eternal Triangle with Only in the Night. Um, it's on. Situation 2, which is a indie post-punk label from the early 80s, and they did some grungy stuff in the late 80s, early 90s. This is from 84, and it's not really uh, post-punky, it's, it's new wave, I guess, I don't know. But I like the uh, image and the fact that it's on Situation 2 made me want to buy it. We got uh, Eurythmics. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. When tomorrow comes, nothing special there. 
and uh, Revival. Again, nothing too special there. Um, then we got Everything But The Girl with uh, Each and Everyone. This is in uh, Blanco y Negra. A Negro, sorry. Um, this is something I picked up from my girl. She used to love this band a lot. I don't know about it right now, but yeah, she enjoyed it. Extreme more than words. Um, it's cheesy, I know. But yeah, sometimes you pick up stuff for your girlfriend. The next one, I'm so stoked I have it, except I'm gonna first show you the vinyl. See, it's unplayable. There's a warp in it that's the size of, I don't know, my, uh, the size of a deep cliff, I don't know. See, it's here. It's on mute, by the way. But it's their second release ever, and that is Fat Gadgets, um, Back to Nature, Back to Back to Nature slash The Box. And I'm stoked that I found this on seven inch, even if it's hardly playable. I can play it, but it's not really good, I guess. Here we have the farm with all together now. And I've got Groovy Train, which, yeah, is a UK press. That's the cool thing about 7 inches and collecting them. Here in Europe you find 7 inches from different countries, from Holland, Belgium, Germany, France, England. So you always find something. This is a Flock of Seagulls, Space Ace love song which I love, I love Fleck of Seagulls. Um, this is a rarity, because I don't really collect picture discs, I hate them, because I don't see the point in it. You put them on your record player and you, what's it? I mean, it's a picture that spins. But this is a picture disc for Iran by Fleck of Seagulls. Then, um, this is Nightmares. I have Flock of Seagulls and uh, Never Again the Dancer. This is from, I guess, not their last, but their second to last album, which is still a good track. And then I also found this most recently, uh, Who's That Girl? She's Got It from 85. Uh, all of these are in Jive. Then we go to the Frankie Goes to Hollywood collection, because I got a couple of their 7 inches, including this pretty defaced copy of uh, Relax. Um, if I ever find a better copy, I'll pick that one up, but for now, this is the one I have, and the one I'll keep. Two Tribes by Frankie Goes to Hollywood. And the power of love. I guess these were their first three uh, singles, because I don't know if you can see it. If it's in reverse, I don't know, but it says here the third single. I don't know why I'm showing that. This is uh, Welcome to the Pleasure, uh, Pleasure Dome, 7 inch. This is from their second album, Liverpool, Rage Hard, which I, I love that song. And uh, there's two more, I guess, from them. This is Warriors of the Wasteland. And 
And lastly, this is watching the wildlife. And yeah, it says use a condom down there. Uh, again, the UK copy. I love UK copies, by the way. Uh, let's see, we got the Funboy 3, they're closing it down. Uh, this is Funboy 3 with Bananarama. Ain't what you do, it's the way that you do it. Some people might say this is the best Bananarama song ever. Uh, this is Telephone Always Rings. And then, um, lastly, uh, wait a minute. It's the Tunnel of Love featuring the Lunacy Legacy on the B side. And that's it. I'm calling it quits now. Hopefully, I can upload a new um, program on my laptop. If not, if the quality is better here, I'll use this. And, um, I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.